Hello, my name is Kaylin Duffy. I am a recently graduated student from the Faculty of Law at the University of Alberta in Alberta, Canada. Uh, I am here on the OWL internship working at the Faculty of Law here at Bielefeld University. Uh, my first impressions were generally pretty positive. Bielefeld is a very green city. Uh, at this time of year in Canada, it is not very green. So uh, it was definitely very beautiful to look at. Um, all the flowers were in full bloom. The trees were in full bloom. It was gorgeous. My allergies didn't love it so much, but I loved it a lot. Um, as for, you know, sort of like my first week here, it's definitely a little bit stressful. Like you're really jet lagged. Um, or at least I was really jet lagged, even though I tried to combat that by not sleeping on the plane. Um, so you're, you're a bit jet lagged, you're stressed, you're moving, you're moving in. Um, for me, I definitely had some issues with the Wi-Fi because the student residence where I'm staying doesn't have Wi-Fi, just an Ethernet cable. So it was a little bit of stress as I was setting that up, but you know, eventually we got it resolved. Um, the, uh, the people here uh, definitely were very, very, very helpful with that. They were very quick to get everything moving. Uh, so I was very appreciative of that. And honestly, once everything uh, got set up, uh, the stress level went like way down um, and I was pretty happy after that. Uh, so some of my fa favorite places at Bielefeld University so far are I really like my office actually. It's really nice, it's big, it's spacious, it has a really 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 nice uh, view. Um, I also really like the Vest End uh, Cafe. I eat there a lot. Wi-Fi signal is really good so uh, it's nice to go there. Um, those are really the only two places that I spend a lot of time with here. Um, I like the stairs that disappear into nothing in the main hall. It's always fun to go in and see those and be like, I wonder where they went to at one point and they just decided to end them there. Um, it's something you'd see in Edmonton, which is interesting. Edmonton has some interesting design choices. Um, so yeah, I'd say that those are probably the two places that I spent the most time for sure. A few moments that I like to remember, um, so my friend came up to visit me actually for a week from Canada uh, and we got to go and hike up to the castle, uh, Spadenburg, it was really cool. Um, we sat through an entire uh, tour in German, luckily he speaks better German than I do so he understood about 75% of it, I understood about 50% of it but I was a historian before I became uh, lost before I went to law school and so basically I've been to a lot of castles and there's not much you can tell me about castles that I can't already figure out for myself at this point um, but it was really really cool we really enjoyed it uh, we climbed to the very top of the tower it was nice and cheap we think we paid like I can't remember if it was two euros altogether or two euros each so four euro altogether but uh, it was really cheap it was really fun we walked around for a bit after uh, I also joined uh, sort of a singing group at the old Nikolai Kirche um, uh, that sings on Fridays and they actually sang some songs that I grew up with weirdly back in Canada so uh, it was actually really nice. Uh, one piece of advice I'd have for people coming here is don't be an island. So uh, I, like I said I was lucky enough to be landed with a fantastic roommate who I get along with really 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 well. Um, but you know, for other people who might come and do this program, because I know some people stay in Airbnbs, I did the student housing, um, I'd really recommend, if you can, um, making at least one really good friend. Like, don't just sit here all by yourself, yeah. because uh, it can definitely get really isolating, uh, especially depending on your language proficiency. Uh, which is another thing, don't automatically expect that everyone is going to speak English. Uh, I summarize my experience here at Bielefeld University as a as a good one. Uh, I'm generally a perpetually anxious person, so um, I like to kind of push myself out of those bubbles because otherwise I become very insular and isolated. Um, so this definitely helped me um, actually in general feel less anxious about things because I figure if I can come here and I can tackle everything in a language that isn't my first language, then eventually when I go back to Canada, I will look at all the Canadian legal documents and landlord contracts and stuff that I have to sign and I'll be like, I've got this. Absolutely. No anxiety present there. Um, so that's definitely been, I think, a positive uh, experience for me here in Bielefeld. Um, and yeah, 